Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to set up a static IP on my Ethernet interface of my Raspberry Pi running FPP. Now, as you'll see here, I already have a wireless interface set up and that's going to my home network, but I want to connect a controller via a hardwired connection to this Pi. Then the Pi can act as a remote to give me wireless uh, controller out in the front yard. Because this instance of FPP is going to be connected directly to a controller, there's no router or DHCP server out there. They're going to be connected directly one to each other. So I need to set up static IPs on both to allow them to talk to each other. Now to do that, I'm going to go to status control and network. I've selected Ethernet 0 and I'm going to put in a static IP address. So I'm going to give it one uh, 192.168.10.1 to keep it separate from everything else. My net mask is going to be 255.255.255.0 for a standard uh, what's called a slash 24 uh, network. My gateway needs to be the default gateway of the device. Now the full name of a gateway is actually gateway of last resort and it's the place that the computer will send uh, IP packets or internet packets if it doesn't know where else to send them. Now because I've already got a wireless LAN set up that is going to be my gateway is going to be on the end of that wireless LAN. So in this case my gateway is going to be but yours may vary. So you only have one default gateway on a device. You might have to enter it more than once uh, on different interfaces, but you will only have one default gateway. So I'm gonna update interface. It says, don't forget to set a DNS IP address. Um, you may use 8888 or 1111. I don't need to do that in this case because it will be pulling the DNS and uh, the DNS IP uh, directly from the Wi-Fi interface. So there we go. I've updated my interface. If I go into host and DNS, um, I can leave those on DHCP and we're done. I can now reboot. And in a few moments, my Pi will come back up configured with the, with the static IP on the Ethernet interface. And here it comes. The Pi is just finishing rebooting. I've just seen the, uh, the header update there. And if I close that now, we can see that we've got two interfaces configured. My wireless LAN is on 4.77 and my ethernet zero is on 10.1. So there we go. Oh, it's having a think. There we go. That's, uh, that's the setting up of a static IP on your ethernet uh, interface. So as usual, I hope you found this useful. Take care, have fun, and I'll see you on the next one.